Hi. I'm still not talking to you. Well, technically. Look, can we just go? Look, can I just drop you off at the station? No, I've got too many bags. Yeah, why have you got... Look, I said, can we just go? Sure. You seem both happy but angry today. You know, I don't think I've actually seen you genuinely fully happy this month. Well, it's only the third. Okay, no, I haven't seen you genuinely fully happy uh, within the last month, okay? I think you should dump him. I'm really happy, thanks. It's just for some reason when I get in this filthy car, I can feel all of the joy seep out of me. As soon as I get out of this car, I feel free again. I guess it just makes me feel grateful. A bit like being a hostage released. This car is awesome. Apart from the uh, crisp explosion in the boot last month, that, that, that can be helped. Apart from that, it's spotless. Yeah. Crisp explosion. Oh. oh, Michael. All my bags are going to stink of chicken crisps now. Beef and onion, actually. For... Look, why do you do these things? I was transporting some wood for a friend, okay? I forgot to have my meat flavour multi pack on the back seat. This happens, okay? It made quite a, a bang, actually. Like a, a big savoury bomb. <laughs> no, don't worry about the smell. Just, just squirt your bags with deodorant or something. I've got, I've got some Lynx Africa, if you want it. You're transporting some wood for a friend? Yeah. If yeah, Brian, he asked me to um, pick up some wood. I'm sorry, okay? Do you want to hear some pop music? No. Cool. Silence it is then. Lovely, glorious silence. Why did you have to do it, Michael? I forgot the multi-pack was there, okay? It's just really... It's, it's, it's really hard trying to pick up all those crumbs. Especially when my car hoover's broken now. I'm not talking about the crisps. I'm talking about last weekend. Oh. That. Which bit of last weekend in particular? Saturday. Which bit of Saturday? Particular. Both bits. Oh, so no preference then between the um, funeral and the pub. Well, they were both pretty bad, weren't they? Yeah. Look, in my defence... Go on, then. Give me a sec. Look, I've got some um, fantastic 80s on the go at the moment. Human League, wham, anything you want to hear? No. After what you did last weekend, I think you deserve long, painful silence. <laughs> I think you're flirting with me. No, I'm not, Michael. Your um, family seemed quite well last weekend. Well, as well as you can be at a funeral. I mean, I, th I thought they handled it very well. You know, very, very composed. Thanks. Feel free to write up a full report and I'll forward it on to them. 
really nice to catch up with your sister as well. And Rory, you know, he's, he's put on weight, hasn't he? That wasn't Rory. They split up last year. That explains it. So, um, what's in the bags? Did Jennifer enjoy your show last Saturday night? I asked you a question first. Stuff. What stuff? It's personal. Be like that then. Look, despite what you tried to convince my family last weekend, we're not going out anymore, Michael. You have no right to know what's in my bag. In fact, even if we were going out, you'd still have no right. It would be like you asking to rummage through my phone and read my messages. Girls need privacy sometimes. Well, I don't need to read your messages. I know what to say anyway. If you're like, ooh, lots of messages from Adrian saying, why, why did your ex-boyfriend suddenly decide to be a comedian and then be better at it than me? <laughs> Is that what you think happened? Yeah, I was hilarious last weekend. <laughs> you were doing his act. I agree, it was quite similar. It was word for word. Words are... Subjective. What? Huh? Words are subjective. What do you mean by that? Look, okay, he must have been proud, wouldn't he? Seeing his work just going down so well. All he has to do is just sit back and watch his, his art come to life on stage. He was a bit confused by it all. Maybe he just realised uh, our material isn't as good as I thought it was after all. <laughs> Maybe I've helped him out, you know. I bought him a pint afterwards, so I, I, it was genuinely lovely to see him again, but I think maybe I helped him. And if there's anything else I can do? Look, I didn't know you were going to be there. Obviously. I was just trying to impress Jennifer. We... Tell her Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Are you guys okay, or...? Yeah, no, no, it's, it's fine now. It's just, um... She was annoyed because I was, I was late for dinner at Nando's because I had to go to your granddad's funeral. And you know, I needed to cheer up somehow. So we got drunk, and then I saw that there was this comedy open mic thing going on. And, and Matey Boy Zach was still in my head from the week before, so I thought, yeah, and uh, I went, went and did that. And, and it worked, didn't it? Had to go. Yeah. I felt like I had to. You know, I was, I was getting those vibes from you. You're unbelievable. Yeah. sexy. <laughs> yeah, I decided to get a lift with him. Easier with all this stuff. No, no, just bags today. Boxes next week. He says sorry, by the way, for last weekend. Don't you? Yeah, sorry. We'll be with you in five. <laughs> Love you. <laughs> Stop it. I'll see you soon. You're moving in with him, aren't you? Yes. I wasn't quite sure how to tell you. So but... why? Because it's the right thing to do. We've just opened the Bristol branch and I've got a senior management position. It shouldn't be about your career, Emily. You know, you've... you've only just met the man. You can't go around moving in with people willy-nilly. It feels right, Michael. Mike. Look at me, I'm mugging zero stuff and you move without even knowing it. Well, you're such a lovely man, Michael. And you did say earlier, if there's anything you can do. So, 
This is it then? No. I'm still in Cambridge for another week, so if you're around next week, or if you come down to visit your pretty lady. If that's too cheeky, I understand. No, 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 it's, it's cool. No, no, I'll, I'll, I'll pick you up. Yeah, old time's sake. <laughs> we can still hang out. I'm really happy, Michael. And I know you are too. Jennifer's perfect for you. I'm so happy you found your one. She has a tattoo of Tom Hanks. She's quirky. <laughs> She's fun. She's good for you. You are happy, aren't you? Yeah. 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 Bye, Michael.